Okay, now that you have mastered the squat pull, you're asking what's next in the pull-up progression. We have this thing called the jump pull. For the jump pull, you're going to require either a pull-up bar and a bench or if you have something as versatile as the gymnastics ring, you're going to use that. If you are using a pull-up bar, you're going to just place a bench below the pull-up bar to a point where you can reach onto the pull-up bar itself. But if you have the rings, you're going to use the rings instead. Basically, what you're going to do is you're going to jump up while you drive your elbows down towards the ground and then slowly lower yourself back down into that full lengthened position. Quick demo on how it looks like. Right, so grabbing onto the ring, you're going to jump up and drive your elbows down, slowly back down into that lengthened position. And slowly back down. Now notice how I don't let my feet touch the floor first because you want to be in that full stretch position at the bottom of the movement. If you have a pull-up bar and a bench, you're going to do the same thing basically. Depending on your height, you might be slightly above the bar or you might be slightly below. Right? The concept is the same. Uh, you're going to hold that position at the top and slowly lower yourself back down. Now combine this with the lat pull-down and the squat pull. You're going to get your pull-ups in no time. So give it a try.